So is GPU mining profitable in June 2019? So let's mine away. Hello guys, Bit Truth here. Today we're going to talk about GPU mining. Today we're going to talk about one of the three best cards in G you know in the GPU mining space. And is it really worth to start GPU mining and some different options and some tips, of course, like uh, always. So we're going to look at one of the three best miners, okay, the 1080 Ti, also the 1660 Ti and the VII or the Radeon 7 or VII. So let's start with the 1080 Ti, GTX 1080 Ti. Now we're getting $1.29 profit on NiceHash. Now I want to give you a tip right here. Do not always look at the daily profitability because daily K okay, is, you know, you, the whole, you know, idea of cryptocurrency mining is for the long term to hold, you know, the cryptocurrencies in your wallet until they reach a good price like now. For example, if you've been mining since January or since November 2018, maybe, okay, you might, you know, have a lot of these cryptocurrencies that you've been accumulating through mining. And that's what we always, you know, focus on. You know, you need to accumulate and not get paid only in Bitcoin. I mean, Bitcoin is good, but of course, getting the other cryptocurrencies are much more profitable, like Grin, Beam. Also, you had, you know, Ravencoin in the old days. So anyways, 1.29. Now, another tip is never to buy, a, you know, a new card. Okay, for example, GTX 1080 Ti, mainly because they are inflated prices. I mean, for the same price, maybe you can get, like, for example, a laptop with, like, a GTX 1060. You know, a really good laptop that you could use other than just dump all this to mining. Because $1,300, you're not going to ROI anytime soon. And uh, the best prices are on eBay. Now, on eBay, you need to buy used ones, nearly good used ones. You don't want something that has been used for years or you're going to have some problems. Now, the thing I want to say, the difference between these two sellers is that this seller, for example, is a big, you know, uh, trader or a big, you know, miner because he has sold 25, you know, the 25 GTX 1080s, where did he get them from? And they're all used. So they're mining. He says he includes them from the retail package. Excellent condition. That is not excellent condition because when you're mining with a crypto with a card, okay, with a GPU, you no, know, it wears off with time. Like it takes just two years. If this guy has been mining for two years, okay, and you start mining right now, maybe like a couple months and then it will break off. Another thing is that when you want to buy, really focus on people that have been selling on low amounts, low prices, and of course, you know, an EVGA or MSI company. You don't want to go for Gigabyte or Zotac, mainly because EVGA, MSI, they have better warranties. If this comes with one, I'm not sure if it does. Anyways, uh, the calculations, 464 days to break even, which is not bad, mainly. Because uh, the Ant Miner S9J, some people in the community have been buying this miner in Canada and in countries that are near, you know, North America. And basically, Mining Cave sells those for $324. And uh, these ones are really old generation, like 14 terahashes. Right now, we have miners with 53, 56 terahashes per second, which is much more stronger. Now, here it says out of stock, but if it, you know, becomes more available then there will sell more now also bitmain has stopped selling you know ant miners s9j because it's really not worth to even produce them no one will buy them not even companies or big you know sites or anything so um, you know if we want to calculate you know it's like 607 days so it's really even worse than a gpu which never has happened in the history of cryptocurrency mining but Anyways, let's go to the next one, which is the 1660 Ti, the GTX 1660 Ti. Now, on MTP, which is Zcoin, it goes for 72 cents profitability. And also, do not look again on the daily profitability, look on the long term. Okay, that's how you ROI faster. It's on MTP, so if we go right here, if we go to the NVIDIA website, we do not need to buy used ones because the 1660 Ti, let's be honest, it's not been f out for long, so this is like regular price. So here it is, MSI G4 1660 Ti Armor OC, okay, 6 gigabytes, it's about 402 days, so the 1660 Ti, okay, even though a couple months ago, at least like two, okay, it was really one of the best miners out there, okay, now it has, you know, beaten the GTX 1080 Ti, but not other miners, you know, so uh, keep, you know, an eye on this, okay, you can buy the GTX 1660 Ti or the 2880, 
TI, I'm not sure, you know, the 2080 TI, you know, the RTX versions have some problems right now, you know, the RTX still, I think you need to wait an, until like 4-3 years, okay, until they get, you know, better versions of the RTX, so better uh, fixes and other things. So anyways, let's go to the Radeon BII. Okay, right here. Now, the problem is I do not like AMD cards, mainly because they always focus on one algorithm at a time. For example, if we look right here on the ETH hash, okay, you have $1.30 on nice hash. Even though, let's say ETH hash or, you know, most ERC20 tokens or, you know, Ethereum as itself, you know, becomes, uh, you know, forks or becomes proof of stake or something, you're going to rely on like 92 cents per profit, okay, or on other versions of Ethereum, like, you know, on other forks like the Ethereum Classic. Basically, what I'm trying to say right here, never buy, a, you know, an AMD card, mainly because you're at risk of these algorithms happening something to them like just like the rx 588 gigabytes you know it used to be one of the best miners back in 2017 but if you go back in my videos like a month or two ago you know you had the rx 580 in negative profitabilities it was not even profitable on the eth hash algo mainly because ethereum was at really you know undervalued prices at 89 dollars 120 dollars so mining Ethereum with an RX 580 is just you know you're losing money unless you hold the bags for long term that's a different thing. So the Radeon VII if we calculate it's about $1.30 which is not bad for a $680 card okay and um, the 1080 Ti you know it's selling at used and getting about $1.29 while this you're getting a new one $680 so uh, I think it's worth the Radeon VII more than actually the GTX 1080 Ti so 523 days even though the ROI is different I think the GTX 1080 Ti you know you should buy it because the thing is about these you know team red and team green you know you don't you don't want to be at risk of losing okay your money so uh, if Radeon VII or GTX 1080 Ti why not get them both and put them in the same rig you know anyways this is the RX 580 Okay, it is for 37 cents profit now should you buy it to be honest no I bought one and I regret to be honest uh, it's not really worth it now what is the best option you know even though GPU mining is right now all mixed up and you know profitability is not the best to be honest I would get the bitmain and miner s17 now on coin mining central they have it on sale till 1779 pounds Okay, now in you now the b best thing about Coin Mining Central is that they are you know they have free shipping fees inside the UK and Europe, you know at least on the reviews I read about them. So uh, if that is you know it's really if you're in Europe I would buy from them because getting from China you know even though they're sold out right now, as you can see for sixteen hundred dollars, you know even though the price is a bit cheaper okay in terms of dollars. It's shipping in September while this one is shipping in July so I think this batch is you know you will ROI faster if you buy one right now I'll have the link down in the description you can look at it so is GPU mining worth it okay basically I would say it is worth it okay depends on where you live it's really dependent on the electric rate and the price of the card you buy which is common sense, but of course, you know, some people live in Europe and tell me what cryptocurrency, you know, should I buy or what card, what GPU should I buy? You know, the other day I had, you know, a friend from Switzerland, okay, talk to me about, you know, what GPU should I buy? And, you know, I went to Switzerland before to Zurich and basically there, you know, the price of a water bottle is like three francs or something or, you know, three pounds three pounds for a water bottle okay imagine the electric rate there you know and you know the prices there are really huge like you know mining there is like even with an ASIC you won't profit okay you won't make a profit so if you live in Europe and you know in the UK and those countries where the electric rate is really overinflated, I suggest you stick to ASICs like these okay mainly to make some profit 
and uh, if you live in the US I would suggest you get you know if you can some GPUs because I think GPUs will not get that much uh, you know that much inflated prices because um, you guys have eBay okay in the US also we have one in the UK but it's not that one you know it's not that huge as the US one so uh, the USA has one of the best GPU prices so if you live in the USA okay I su suggest you start mining so uh, GPU mining is worth it to answer the question and ASIC mining so uh, thank you guys for watching this video and uh, see you guys on the next video